Well, thanks everyone for joining us back. Wonderful corn recipes, that's what we're doing here today. Halibut, and yes. you're gonna cook this one for me. You're gonna show me how it's I done. I will. So the first thing we'll do is season it with uh, salt and pepper. We're gonna sear this, correct? Yeah, we're gonna pan roast it. We'll start it in a hot pan. Olive oil, that's all we're doing. No, we're gonna use actually canola oil. Oh, you are? Okay, yeah. all right. And uh, we're gonna start by putting the flesh side down first. Okay. And as soon as this gets a little bit caramelized on the one side, then we'll place it in the oven and finish it off. Now for the accompaniment, correct? Uh -huh. Oh, look at that, there it goes. We're gonna take some of the chanterelles, which are gorgeous. Yeah, they're gorgeous. I mean, look at that color. <sighs> that's beautiful. Mm. You want to put it beautifully yeah, in yeah. the pan? I do. <laughs> I think it's gorgeous. Right from there, we're going to add some corn. Okay. And then we're going to add a little bit of shallot. I'm surprised, Janine, not a lot of garlic usage out of you. No, I'm a shallot girl. You are? <laughs> okay, all right. And then we're going to add a little bit of our heirloom oh. tomatoes. Yeah. And we'll season that with a little salt and pepper. Now, the halibut will stay in the oven for how long? About six to eight minutes on a 375 degree oven. Oven, okay. We're gonna add just a little bit of sherry. Oh, okay. This is gonna bring out the sweetness in the corn and the mushrooms. All right. And she's uh, flipping it in that pan. <laughs> Us at home, we could use a spoon or something that... Uh... <laughs> and then um, I'm gonna add some fien herbs. Um, today I'm using dill and tarragon, a little bit of chives. I like that, I smelt the dill. One of my last fav favorite ingredients. White truffle oil. Ah. Smell that. Oh yeah. Check on our fish. How's it looking? Oh, it's looking really nice. Okay, perfect. We're gonna go to a quick break. When we come back, you'll see the beautiful color and the accompaniment to the perfectly roasted halibut. We'll be right back. It really looks great in there. Yeah, it's coming right it's along. Coming. I see. Well, thanks everyone for joining us back. Now, we haven't forgotten about you, but we did do a few things while you were away. We pulled the halibut out of the oven. We did. We basted it with a little butter. Just a little bit of butter. Yeah, nice thing. Just gives it a little, a little something, more something. flavor. Oh yeah, I love that. All right, and we're gonna plate that up. And to me, actually, Janine, it, it smells fantastic. But the chanterelles, and the corn's the star today, cause it's, you know, but the chanterelles. And always the white truffle oil. Yeah, I mean, it just, <laughs> it stole the show. All right, look at that, perfect. Oh, look at that halibut. Are you happy? I am. She's happy. This one is easy for you to do at home. Remember, they are on our website, bringitthome.com. Janine, we have one more to do. We're one doing more. a corn pudding. Corn pudding. All right, here we go. We'll be right back. This looks fantastic.